What is up guys? Mitch here from Sneaky Bugger Outdoors. Currently in the old Ford F-150 on our way up to Lake Kawagama, which is on the border of the Halliburton Highlands and Algonquin, I believe. So we're gonna be targeting lake trout today. There's supposed to be a lot of lake trout in that lake. Uh, and I've heard there's a couple big ones. So we'll see if we can't get hooked up into uh, a bit of a tank. But yeah, late start this morning. Had an idler pulley go on the truck last night when I got home and it was rate shot bearing out of it. So had to go to the parts store, pick that up, replace that. But we're on our way now. We're rolling through uh, Buckhorn, Ontario. Still got probably about two more hours to go, but with the help of a bit of movie magic, uh, we should be able to see you guys on the water. Boom. What is up guys out here at the lake now? Just got here, first time being at this lake, didn't really do a lot of scouting before. Don't really know what spots I'm gonna hit. So gonna have to spend a couple minutes definitely figuring it out. Um, let's see what the water temp, water temp's 44. So it is pretty cool. So, I mean, hopefully the lake trout, they'll be a little bit shallow, a little bit easier to get at and definitely interesting. It's not off that you can cast the lake trout. So gonna try that out for a bit. If that doesn't work, gonna have to find a spot that looks half decent on bottom. Probably thinking probably like 70 to 50 feet where we can start jigging for them. And uh, yeah, but we're just gonna have to see and uh, stay tuned. Hopefully we get one. All right, folks, rolled up to the first spot here. We're gonna try out. The structure's looking pretty good. Uh, looks like it's gonna be about 80 feet and it comes up to 40 on each side. I'm kind of fishing a, a valley. So give it a go. Uh, for the first setup here, we're gonna try out the old uh, musky setup with the six inch uh, white tube and I think it's a three ounce jig head. So definitely the rod line i my opinion i think it's a little heavy but should get it done if we don't get any hits on that i might downsize i do have a small spinning reel call it the canadian tire special got a canadian tire for maybe 40 bucks uh but yeah give that a go a little bit smaller tube a little bit lighter jig uh, if we're gonna have to finesse them but i don't think so the water temperature looks really good so we're gonna see gonna see if we can't make it happen but yeah here for the lakers hopefully they'll bite <laughs> Woo! All right, coming here into about 7.30 now. Been out all day, well not all day, but. Oh, finally got a fish in the net and it's a Laker. So they paid off. Of course, not till the final wee hours this actually happens, but anyways, I'll get it out here. Look at that there. Beautiful. <laughs> Love it. I love to see it. Love to see it. Oh, should I keep you, bud? Or should I let you get big? Oh, you can go back. I love those fish. Yeah, so I just want to talk about that fish a little bit more. That was a really rewarding fish, uh, especially when you've been going at it all day and you don't get a hit or a bite or anything and then you're about to give up and then you finally get that that hit it makes it worth it so that fish there um i caught on a dipsy diver and a uh purple blue and silver spoon at about well not at about it was at 40 feet that's where i have the dipsy set to and i'm fishing about 50 60 feet of water so my structure is topping out at about uh, like 45 feet in some spots. So I'm just trying to skim right over the surface and hopefully if there are any trout hanging out down below in those rocks and valleys that they'll see the spoon come over and hit it. And I think that's what happened on that one. So got the Dipsy back in, trolling. So uh, right now, just going back to the boat launch. We'll see if we can't make one more happen before the end. Now, just, there's a lot bigger in this lake as well. Um, it'd be nice to get to one of those, but like I said, any fish, any fish after a slow, slow day is real rewarding. But yeah. 